hello welcome to electrical stuff this is a channel where we can learn the electrical knowledge in the building sectors today's our topic is what is 30 milliampere and 100 milliampere rating on elcbs welcome all today's our topic is on elcbs it is written as 30 milliampere 100 milliampere and 300 milliampere etc what is these values what is relation why it is required let us see in this video so now i'm going to show you with the example uh, what is this what it means okay now this is my transformer okay and then this is my transformer so this is my phase wire and this is my neutral wire i am here i am putting my sorry i am putting here my elcb this is my elcb or rccb okay then these val these wires i connected to my load clear so now let's see this elcb value i am consider a 40 30 milliampere we have to be consider this value okay 30 milliampere what is this value so now our voltage v is equal to what is our voltage v is equal to 240 volts okay then what is our uh, current i is equal to 30 milliampere how we can return i value 30 by 1000 ampere we can return this is why i consider 240 it is a single phase this load is a single phase load okay so what is the formula for single phase load p is equal to v into i into cos pi this is for single phase single phase for single phase load or single phase voltage formula power formula we substitute these values v is equal to 240 i is equal to 30 divided by 1000 what is power factor value i'm um, 0.8 so what is if you summarize this value you are, it is getting around 5.76 watts okay wattage i mean consider approximately 6 wattage so it is your elcb is going to trip this your elcb is going to trip the whole uh, power wattage is approximately equal to 6 watts or more then your elcb is going to trip this is the meaning of 40 ampere 30 milli ampere so now we will be see with a case if for example uh, this is the man here this guy this guy this is the man he touch with the phase wire so what will happen the current will be passed through him and it will be transferred to the our transformer okay so this human being wattage is 1000 wattage okay a dry human so 1000 wattage and then the earthing of transformer near i that is 10 ohms so now substitute the values we will be see what is the fault current what is the wattage whether our elcb is going to trip or no or uh, let us see okay so now here again voltage formula v is equal to 240 volts okay then what is i this is the here i fault current if i written here this is the if what is if i don't know so i put it fault current if what is the value of resistance value of resistance this 1000 plus 10 so i can i put rt as a thousand plus 10 ohms it is equal to 1010 ohms okay this is the value then so substitute the values again uh, how can i get the what is the formula voltage is equal to i into r into cos pi this is also our formula for single phase so what substitute these values you can get if value 
what is this if okay if if value v is equal to 240 volts what is the value of r r is equal to 1010 into uh, sorry cos pi it will be coming here okay so pointed what is the value coming here means let us see i'm calculating 240 okay divided by 1010 into 0 0.8 it is equal to 0 0.29 amperes are coming okay so this is the ampere so this ampere is 0 0.29 ampere passing through this person okay whether our uh, elc be tripping or no we don't know still 0.9 so when it will be trips as per the uh, previously six voltage P, P is equal to 6 voltage then it is going to trip our ELCB okay so whether this 6 0 0.29 value it is tripping or no we don't know let us see this is IF value we got it now power formula I square R into cos pi okay so substitute the value I is equal to 0 0.29 whole square into r value this is the value 1010 into cos pi value 0.8 how much it is coming we will see okay 0 0.9 into 0 0.29 okay then 1010 into 0 0.8 it is coming around 69.6 wattage so your elcb uh, will be automatically it will be trip it is six wattage it is going to trip so i hope you understand how the elcb is functioning so if it is a elcb for 30 milliampere if it is a six wattage it is getting trip now in this case as a human being if he touch thousand watts the fault current it will be flow 0 0.29 ampere so this ELCB 69.6 wattage is there. So this wattage, our ELCB already senses it is more than 10 times. So our ELCB is going to trip. This is how ELCB is function. ELCB works. I hope you understand. Thanks for watching. Do like my videos and do share with uh, your friends as well as subscribe to Electrical Stuff. Good day. Bye-bye.